Dan's interdisciplinary scholarship is outstanding in its breadth and depth. He is recognized as an intellectual giant in environmental psychology. His exceptional contributions have made him among the top handful in the world. His trailblazing research in interdisciplinary team science, social ecology, and psychology of the electronic age have received singular acclaim. Dan's creative theorizing, innovative methods, and novel analytical techniques have influenced researchers worldwide. His unique ability for identifying pragmatically significant questions have impacted public health and wellness, medicine, nursing, planning, and design. Dan is an exceptional scholar and teacher, but what makes him unique is his character. Dan is extremely persistent and always respectful. His generosity and loyalty to family, to friends, to colleagues, and to his many students over the years are legendary. Dan's persistence was critical in the growth of social ecology from a program to a full-fledged multi-department school. This endeavor took four years of grueling efforts on Dan's part. Dan treats people with respect and kindness, even when there are differences of opinion. And last but not least, he is a wickedly good keyboardist. We are so grateful to Dan and for Dan. As both an undergraduate and a graduate student, I was so impressed with the way Dan cared about his students. He was truly invested in student success and I am thankful for the opportunity to have worked with them as a postdoc on a worksite illness and injury prevention grant. This gave me a chance to see how truly collaborative and inclusive Dan is. He really brought out the best in his team members. When I think about leadership, the traits that come to mind are honesty, vision, transparency, inclusion, a sense of purpose, and all those characteristics describe Dan. Please welcome to the stage, the inaugural recipient of the Social Ecology Founders Award, Professor Daniel Stokels. Thank you all so much. Uh, that was extremely kind. I appreciate all the wonderful comments of my colleagues and former students in that video. I thank Dean Guerra, Provost Lavernia, who's here tonight, and all the folks whose shoulders I've stood on since coming to UCI. And speaking of founders, I want to mention uh, a few that preceded me here at UCI. You know, I've always felt extremely lucky to have gotten that phone call from UCI professor Ray Catalano back in 1973 when I was finishing up my PhD at the University of North Carolina. And he was inviting me on behalf of Professor Arnold Binder, the founding director of the program in social ecology, to come out to UCI for a job interview. And I was about to accept an offer at a larger, more established university. UCI was only eight years old at the time. And I was skeptical that I'd ever wind up in social ecology at UCI. I couldn't even locate Irvine on a map at the time. <laughs> but I was intrigued by the launch of an interdisciplinary, ecologically oriented, community engaged program at UCI. And I decided to go out to California for the interview. And I have to say, once I met with the gregarious, iconoclastic faculty in social ecology during my visit, I was hooked. On the plane back to Chapel Hill, I decided then and there that if I was lucky enough to get an offer from UCI, that's where I wanted to go for my, my job. And it's been an A-ticket ride ever since. Honestly, rather than signifying anything I've accomplished individually, this award is a tribute to the collective efforts and accomplishments of so many wonderful faculty and staff colleagues, our students, alumni, and friends in the community that I've been privileged to work with since I arrived at UCI in 73. And what our social ecology community has accomplished at UCI was only possible through the sustained support 
of many individuals and organizations, both on campus and beyond, especially our academic senate colleagues in other schools at UCI, and campus administrators like founding chancellor Daniel Aldrich, who saw the potential in Arnie Binder's 1970 proposal to create social ecology at UCI, a proposal which happened to be well ahead of its time, and several other campus leaders who built on Chancellor Aldrich's initial support of the program, and very importantly, former deans Ron Huff, Al Jenis, interim dean Carol Saran, who led social ecology forward, continued to build the school during their deanships, and today, Dean Guerra and her leadership team who are working to take social ecology to the next level. And of course, UCI's current administration headed by Chancellor Gilman and Provost Lavernia who have embraced our school's mission and celebrated its accomplishments. Thank you for that. At the same time, our many community partners have provided field placements for undergraduate majors, fellowship support for our students, chair endowments for our faculty, and so much more. All of these colleagues and friends have been crucial for the success of our efforts. And I also want to say that the love and support of my family, especially my wife Jeannie, who's here this evening, from the very first days of graduate school uh, when we met to the present, and our sons Eli and Andrew have been absolute, absolutely essential and have given meaning to whatever I've been able to accomplish over the course of my career. Looking back over the 48 years since the program in social ecology was created and the first 25 years of our school, there's so much to celebrate. Our talented and diverse faculty who came to UCI to build distinguished departments, innovative curricula, and vibrant research centers. Also, our thousands of students and alumni continue to make important contributions toward advancing science in their respective fields and developing evidence-based solutions to improve local communities and enhance global sustainability. And notably, social ecology has truly been an innovation hub at UCI. Our faculty members have played key roles in helping to create several new initiatives, such as UCI's law school and the program in public health, soon to become the School of Public Health here at UCI. All told, it's been an exciting adventure and a tremendous opportunity to be part of UCI and the social ecology family over so many years. I'm confident that our school is well positioned today to broaden its leadership and innovation in interdisciplinary science, education, and community practice as we embark on the next 25 years of our collective adventure. Thank you all so much. I really appreciate it.